then the Lord spoke to Moses, saying, Speak to the children of Israel, that they bring me an offering from everyone who gives it willingly with his heart, you shall take this my offering and this is the offering which you shall take from them gold, silver and bronze blue, purple and scarlet thread fine linen and god hair Nilo, Vaisani, Radul Hagur, Marmaku, Kapara, Batraka, Buddha, Ram skin, dry red, Bajal skin, and Akasha wood, oil for the light, and spices for the anointing, oil and for the sweet um, incense. Radu Rongli, Rangaika, Heraka, Chalaru, Silka, Chalaru, Babulka, Kart. Badriko Ninti, Badrache Kutil, Abisek Gardetil, Rasugati Turko Ninti Masala. Only stones and stones to be set in the ephod and in the breastplate, and let them make me a sanctuary that I may dwell among them. Eputra Chati Padama, Jarana Kuniti, Alix, Ra Orukisimka, Ratnaru. I According to all that I will show you, that is the pattern of the tabernacle and the pattern of all its furnishing, just so you shall make it. Maine talai dekhaune namuna bhumujin pavitra basistan ra deska sabey saman haru taile banaunu. Amen. 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 I encourage you to read the rest of the chapter. They give, they give the details of how God wanted Moses to make the tabernacle. What we want to pin point in this chapter is that God wanted Moses to make the tabernacle. Moses was the instrument in the tabernacle. to pin point in this chapter is that the inspiration to make the first tabernacle came from God himself. And the money to make this to build this tabernacle came from the people of God. But the money came from the people of God. We live in the time of grace. And by God's grace, and the effort of our dear brother, God has given you a tabernacle. So God can dwell with you here. So God can dwell with you here. Amen. Amen. But it's finishing. You all must put a hand in. The Bible says they should give willingly with their own hearts. It does not matter how much. It is just to show to God. God, me too, I want you to stay among us here. It is a home for God and you. 
यो चाहिँ तपाईँको निम्ति र परमेश्वरको निम्ति घर हो हालेलुया हालेलुया एन्ड एज यु नो अनि हामीलाई थाहा छ मोजेस मोसाले पनि त्यो बनाए आमेन आमेन देन प्रब्लम्स केम लाइक छ अनि त्यसमा चाहिँ चाहिँ समस्याहरु कति बेलामा आए इट वाज डिस्ट्रोयड आ यो पछि नष्ट पनि पारियो द मोजेस वाज नॉट द ओनली वन मोसा मात्र थी एक रो व्यक्ति थी ना पाचीस पेट इन बिल्डिंग गॉड्स टेंपल और मैं सोच को मंदिर बनाने को नीति हुई एक ले ले बनाए को वही ना वन डे एक दिन इट वाज द सेकंड किंग ऑफ इज़राइल त्याने रे रात इज़राइल देश को जो दूसरों राजा किंग डेविड जस्ट को नाम जो दाऊद थियो He loved God so much. उसने जो परमिशन लाये थे प्रेम कर दिए हों। God made him a king. अरे परमिशन ने जो उस लाये थे राजा बनाने में। But one day, तो एक दिन, they were present and singing. तीन तीन ही औरों जो इफ़्रातना कर दिए थे, दिल का उदय, भजन का उदय थे। And then David saw the ark of God. अरे जो इफ़्रात ने दाऊद ने जो परमिशन को संदूक लाये देखे। Which they were taken into the tents. अरे जो जो तीन ही ले जो पाल और मलाद Because from the desert, किनाबने तो उजाड़ी स्थान बाटा, they used to keep it in a tent. तीन ईयर ले जाए तो उपचार दुकले जाए tent में रखने का थे. So it remained a practice to them. और इतने स्पीचार इतने जो जाए उड़ा चलन चलती माँ उन्हें थाली तीन ईयर बुलाएगी. They built a big palace for their king. और इतने तीन ईयर ले जाए राजा को निम्चे ठुलो ठुलो दरवाज़ बनाओ बनाए. But they forgot their gun. तो अब परमेश्वर जो आप थे वो दीवार ऐसे बुलियो. One has they set them free from slavery. अरे तीन ईयर ले जाए आप लोग ऐसे जोश ले जाए दासतो बाटा निकाल लेकर थे. But the Bible says. तो अब Bible नहीं बंद था. David was a man after the heart of God. Bible नहीं बंद था. दाऊद से परमेश्वर को आपने ही देखो मान चाहिए बुलियो. He had the glory. उस अंग महिमा थी वो। But he did not want the glory to him। तो अबे आपने था जो महिमा। He said, How can I live in a very nice palace? अरे उसने इस तो वाले मुझे ये तो मैं ठुलो दरवार पर कुछ नहीं पहुंचना सकता। When the ark of my God was taken between the tents। जब कि परमेश्वर को मेरो परमेश्वर को संदूक से त्यों पाल में बस था। So he said। तेरे कारण ये उसने मने वो। It was also a vision, an inspiration। उस अंग बने उड़ा उदय से थी उस अंग � Temple for my God. अरे मज़े ही मेरे ऊपर नहीं सोचो नहीं तीजे माँ मंड क्या बोलते हैं मंडे ही बसाज़ बनने हो। Amen. Amen. And he followed the same pattern. अरे तेज़ भी चारे उन्हें ते ही नहीं pattern तरीका लाए तो अपना हो। God had already given to Moses. मोसा ने जो दीसा के कुछ ते pattern अपना हो। Amen. Amen. And he made a plan. He put the money together, gold and everything. He took from the people as well. अरे उसने योजना बनाये, उसने पैसा रो, बेटी रो उठाये, उसने सुन चादी माली सर बटन भी न था दे। I'm just going quick because if I read everything, we stay till evening. अरे ते कारण ले मैं लियो छोड़ कर ही मैं बंदे चुए दिमाग ले लाम बोले उसे मरे रात ही समा पुट सही हो। So he he put all the money together. अरे उसने सब ही पैसा से सब के रखो। And he was ready to start building the temple. निर्माण करने के लिए जो तैयारी और सब हुई हो। But God told him। तरह परमेश्वर ने उसे ऐसा बंचा। Stop। रोकी। The idea is perfect। तीन रो सोचा ही रामरो सा। But you are not worthy to build me a tent। तरह तीन के चाहे मेरो मंडली बनाऊंगा बनी थी जेती भी योग्य कर रही हो। Because David was a warrior। किन्हें बने दाव उनसे लड़ा को दिए। He killed the lots। उसले देरे है मारी सके का दिए। He shed blood। उसले देरे ही को रगत बगाए का दिए। God did not want his hand to be part of who will build a church for him। अरे मंडली बसाल लोग नहीं थे जब बर्फ़ सोले थे उसको हाथ प्राय भाई को उन्हें था देने चाहिए। Amen। Amen। Their inspiration is good। प्रेरणा ठीक हो रहा हो। and God wants it. अरे जो ऊपर में सोले चांद सन बने। But it's not just anybody that can do the job. तो अरे जो सभी पूरा जब पर सभी लोग अपने साथ में रहते होंगे। God cares about who does it as well. मन में सोले जो कसले घर रूम पर तो सब अंदर बने हुआ हैं रूम जब। Money can come from everywhere. आ पैसा जहाँ बात अपने आओ ना साथ में। But who does it? तो अरे कसले यो कुछ करो। It's also chosen by God. तो बने 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 बने
जो एवरीथिंग विशेष व्यक्ति इतिहास प्रार्थना कर एक The Lord said he would dwell in a dark cloud. Baaklo adhar ma mo bas kor chu mani bande soli bandu bayo. I have surely built you an an exalted house. Maine ya maine tapai ko nimti uta uchha bande nirman kare ko chu. And a place for you to dwell in forever. Tapai sada sarvada bas kar nu nimti tapai ko nimti uta bas ekam tayar kare ko chu. Then the king turned around and blessed the whole assembly of Israel. And in this particular day, Raja Jai Parkiye the Israel ka sabhi mani sabhi niti cha asis diye. While all the assembly of Israel was standing, uh, jab aur sabhi Israeli aur ubi rahe kathi. And he said, "Unle bade, blessed be the Lord God of Israel, who has fulfilled with his hands what he spoke." With his mouth to my father David, saying, "Since the day that I brought my people out of the land of Egypt, I have chosen no city from any tribe of Israel in which to build a house, that my name might be there. Nor did I choose any man to be a ruler over my people Israel." Yes. परम प्रभु इज़राइल का परमेश्वर लाए प्रशंसा हो जसले मेरा पिता दाऊद संग आपने मुखले बोलने वाले को प्रतिज्ञा आपना हाथ ले पूरा करने वाले को छा किनावनी हुआ ने ये सुमन हुए हो 
मेरो प्रजा लाई मिस्र देश बाट निकाले र ल्याए को दिन देखी यीशु योडा घर मान इजराइल का समय कुल हरु को कुने पनी सहर लाई मेरो नाम कायम रातना लाई योडा मंदिर बनाऊना पनी महिले रोजे को छाई ना रा मेरो प्रजा इजराइल माथी शासन करना महिले कुने मानी पाए अब आप उन्हें लाई चुने को छाई ना even the location of where the church should be, God chooses. Amen. Amen. Yet I have chosen the six Jerusalem that my name may be there. And I have chosen David to be over my people Israel. Let me remind you, beloved. This is the first testimony of King Solomon in front of the congregation. So he's telling the story of how the building of the, the tabernacle started, just like we heard. Now it was in the heart of my father David to build a temple for the name of the Lord God of Israel. But the Lord said to my father David, whereas it was in your heart to build the temple for my name, you did well in that it was in your heart. Nevertheless, huh? okay. Nevertheless, you shall not build the temple, but your son, who will come from your body, he shall build the temple for my name. So the Lord has fulfilled his word which he spoke. And I have filled the position of my father David and sit on the throne of Israel as the Lord promised. And I have built the temple for the name of the Lord God of Israel. Param Prabhu le abadyo pratigya pura ganu bhai pucha. Param Prabhu le pratigya ganu bhai bhamuji. Ma mera pita Daud ko satta ma raja bhai puchu. Ra Israel ko siyasan ma ma virat ma bhai puchu. Aari Param Prabhu Israel ka parmeshon ko nao ko nimti maile yu mandir nirmaan kari puchu. And there are and there I have put the ark in which is the covenant of the Lord, which he made with the children of Israel. Amen. 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 Let me also emphasize on something here. The most important thing within the temple was the Ark of Covenant. Because that was the contract between God and His people. Yes. Every time they will see this covenant, they knew what God has asked them to do. And they knew what God has promised to do. This is the reason why every time Israel was in trouble, they went to the men of God. Amen. What have we done again? Have we violated anything? Just the men of God will speak to God. And God will answer to them. This is where you've gone wrong. You 
And God would tell them exactly what to do. And he would tell them exactly what to do. And and then peace was re-established between God and His people. Amen. Amen. This is the reason why this was not just a brick of walls but it was a place where God was. Amen. It was a place where the word of God was kept. So anyone that was in trouble, he knew where to go. I quickly give you an example. There was a woman called Anne. There was a woman called Anne. She could not have children. And she was sad. People laughed, laughed at her. And she knew that where she could go and cry was in the temple. She would come in the morning. She would sit there. She would start just reminding God. What have I done? And she would say, Why can I not have children? Have mercy on me. And she cried a lot. And there one day, the man of God came to her and said, Why, why are you not respecting this place? This, this is the house of God. You cannot come drunk here. If you want to drink alcohol, go to the places where people drink. But this place must be respected. Amen. If you are coming here, you are talking. Once you reach the door, you keep silent. It's the presence of God. Hallelujah. And then what happened? The man of God said, You can't be drunk in this place. She said, No, man. I'm not drunk. But my problem is hurting me so much that it makes me look like I'm drunk. I don't know how to say it. Drunk is not a nice word. It 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 is not a nice word. And the man of God said, I don't know what your problem is. I don't know what your problem is. I don't know what your problem is. But whatever your problem is, may God grant you and she had a lot of faith. She said, I, I receive it. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Those that come to church, they must expect to have faith. They make wonders. Amen. Amen. In this place, according to how you approach this place, Amen. if you say we are going to the house of God, we are going to meet God, and there he will speak to our hearts, and there he will heal our sick.